Mayor of Detroit delivering an electrifying state of the city address filled with positivity. It's the ninth such address for Mayor Mike Duggan. Blight to beauty was the focus tonight. The mayor proudly pointed out how far the city has come by staying uh, with a look to the future and getting rid of blight from the past. Twelve of the worst buildings in the city are now under redevelopment. And in neighborhoods, the demolition of 23,000 abandoned homes and the refurbishing of 11,000 more. A website for affordable housing in the city is expected to launch later this year. The mayor also announced the expansion of the Motor City Match Program, a grant that helps entrepreneurs in the city. The program makes a massive difference for dozens of Detroit business owners. 7 Action News reporter Brett Cass spoke to one local business who says the program has helped dreams come true. On a much smaller scale than some of those projects Mayor Duggan was talking about, this is also an example of blight into beauty. We're standing inside of the old Kresge Five and Dime store in Jefferson Chalmers, which, as you can see, is in the middle of a renovation, turning into a soul food restaurant, thanks to a popular grant program that is also getting a boost. Hard work and dedication is the soul of Detroit. Order up! And at Detroit Soul on 8 Mile, that hard work and dedication is combined with some classic home cooking. And we serve soul food with a healthier twist. Jerome Brown is one of the co-owners along with his brother Sam. Welcome in. Since the duo opened Detroit Soul in 2015, it's continued to grow. And now seven years later, they've outgrown their small carry out only location. Well, we knew we would grow and we didn't know which way we would grow. We didn't think we would move this fast. So now the brothers are opening a second location in the Jefferson Chalmers neighborhood. Here, up to 80 people can sit and enjoy some Detroit soul. I feel like I hear the excitement in your voice. Oh my God, I'm, I'm, going, I'm going to bust because it, it really is a uh, dream come true. And what helped make this dream come true was a special city program called Motor City Match. Last fall, Detroit Soul was one of the recipients being awarded $60,000 in grant money. And during the State of the City Address, Mayor Mike Duggan said this program is also ready to expand. We have in the past put $500,000 a quarter into Motor City Match. And with council support, that's going up to a million dollars a quarter. We have 130 companies already open in the city for Motor City Match, and we are going to double this. And what does it mean knowing that other Detroiters will have that opportunity now that they're doubling the amount. Oh, wow. That in itself makes me feel number one good, but number two is saying that the city is really trying to come back. A comeback that these brothers say is already in the works. And while addressing vacant buildings remains the focus, the people bringing them back to life are the real story. It means that we can actually move forward and really make our dreams come true. You can expect to walk through the doors here of Detroit Soul sometime in early summer, and they are in the process right now of recruiting new employees. So if you're interested in reaching out, we'll have their contact info on our website, WXYZ.com. In the east side of Detroit, I'm Brett Cast, 7 Action News. Brett, thanks.